Hi everyone, I'm Patricia, the Young Adult Librarian at the Greenville Public Library, and today I'm going to show you how to make your own fidget tool. So you only need a few things. You'll need a pipe cleaner, a popsicle stick, and some beads. We have 10 beads here. You'll also need some tape. So first we're going to string the beads onto the pipe cleaner. And the pipe cleaner has wire in it, so the ends can sometimes be a little pointy. So I'm just going to be careful not to poke myself with the end of the, the pipe cleaner while I'm stringing these beads. And these beads are all green, but they're all different colors of green. So you can make your own pattern if you like. And we're going to push the beads so they're in the center of the pipe cleaner. And then we're going to put the pipe cleaner with the beads on top of the popsicle stick and it might roll because the beads are kind of round and then I'm going to fold the ends of the pipe cleaner over the ends of the popsicle stick and the first time I didn't get it centered so I'm going to refold one end over the end of the popsicle stick And then I'll fold the other end over the other end of the popsicle stick. So it'll look like that, and on the back it looks like that. We use our tape, and we're going to use the tape to secure the ends of the pipe cleaner, which are now wrapped around the ends of the popsicle stick. And this will both help to keep the pipe cleaner in place, and it'll also cover up the pointy end of the pipe cleaner so you won't be poking yourself when you're holding your fidget tool. And I'll just show you what the back looks like too. And I'm going to put two layers of tape because I want it to be extra secure. I don't want these beads going anywhere. And believe it or not, we are done. So here's how to use your fidget tool. You can use your fingers or just your thumb to push the beads back and forth. They make a really nice clicky clacky sound. And you can use them in both hands or just in one hand like this. And if you want to use it while you're writing, you can hold it in your non-dominant hand and then write. Hope you had a lot of fun making your own fidget tool. Thanks for watching and I hope to see you at the library sometime soon.